Hello and welcome to the channel Artisan's Way. Today I show you how to perform search and replace in your WordPress database. So as example, this is my database which name is WP and it has URL localhost slash WP. Here I show you. I click on my options table and it has URL HTTP localhost slash WP. So let's assume I am trying to move my whole site to another server and after moving server I need to replace all these occurrences of URL by my new host URL or new domain. So as example we are going to replace this URL with HTTP localhost slash WP1 let's say or let's say let's replace with localhost slash test so I show you how we can do this so go to your Google and type search place interconnect So download it. Yeah. So I copy this zip and place that zip in my root directory of project here. Now I am extracting this zip. Here we go, search replace db master. So for our simplicity, I keep this small name for this directory, search replace. So what I need to do next step is run that folder through URL, localhost wp search replace. taking a little bit time yeah here we go so this is the UI provided by this library by default and this library search for your WordPress database credentials automatically now here I need to place the value which we are going to replace so I just copy it from here and paste it so I want to replace it with let's say for example test now just scroll down I select all tables if you want to perform a specific table you can click on here I select the specific table like this so for now we are going to perform on all tables so I click on all tables here click on live run ok here you see the progress report just a minute yeah here so this table contains two rows but no sales yet change under options table there are 242 rows and three sales are getting changed progress is still going on It's a very useful library. A lot of times we need this library. Yeah, process gets completed. So now I go to my database and refresh it. Here we go. So this library replaces all occurrences of our URL with the new one. It will also search and replace your serialized data as well so that is the main benefit of this library so i hope you understand the tutorial if you have any questions please leave a comment below thanks for